Demi Lovato and Disney are in legal hot water because of Frozen's Let It Go, and we are officially confused. This episode of Newsfeed is brought to you by Xfinity Mobile. It's a new kind of network. It's been over three years since the release of Disney's Frozen, and now Demi Lovato and Disney are being sued for copyright infringement. What? Well, you heard right. Let It Go is definitely a fan favorite as far as Disney songs go, but all these years later, we're learning that the song may have ripped off a song by Chilean singer Jaime Sierro. And as we all know, since Demi Lovato sang the radio version of the song and Idina Menzel sang the movie version of the song, Jaime is coming after both of them and after Disney too. According to Jaime, the structure of Let It Go as well as the melody, lyrics, and theme are just too similar to the song he wrote back in 2008 called Bolar. Now he's seeking somewhere in the ballpark of, I don't know, $1.3 billion in restitution? Crazy, right? Now, although we're not so sure if this lawsuit will amount to anything, that's shockingly not the only Frozen drama to go down this week. Yeah, some fans on Twitter were extremely disappointed in Pixar's 21 minute long short, Olaf's Frozen Adventure, which played before the latest Pixar film, Coco. Now one person wrote on Twitter, quote, the Frozen short before Coco unforgivably stretches the definition of short, with another adding, unspeakably dreadful, the songs were sludge, the plot idiotic, it made me loathe commercialized Christmas, a holiday I enjoyed as a child with a dark and molten rage. Wow, tell us how you really feel. Okay guys, but now it's your turn. Here's what I need you to do. Go listen to Let It Go, and then go listen to Volar by Jaime Sierro, and let us know in the comments if you think Disney ripped off his song. I listened to it, and Actually, I'll just let you decide. Also, if you've seen it, let us know what you think of the new Frozen short. And of course, thanks so much for watching Clever News. I'm your host, Emil Innis Jr. You can find me at Emil Innis Jr. And I'll see you next time. But before you go, click to the left for more on the rumors that Demi shaded BTS at the AMAs. And thanks again to Xfinity Mobile for sponsoring today's episode. Xfinity Mobile is a new kind of network designed to save you money.